Hi guys and welcome to my first Visual Basic tutorial uh, for Computify and in this uh, tutorial I'm just going to show you how to create a very beginner's application it's going to be a command window uh, the download link for this program is in the description I am using version Microsoft Visual Basic 2010 Express and uh, yes it is free to download and register uh, once you got this downloaded, go back to this video. So what we're going to do when you go to this start page window, uh, click new project. And I'm just going to name the project down here. We're using Windows Formal Application, don't change that. Tutorial. Command window. and ok there will be plenty more tutorials to come as well so you'll end up with this uh, blank windows form and what I'm going to do is I'm just going to size uh, change the size I'm going to add one label uh, one text box and one button and I'll just drag the text box there like that and I'm just gonna on the label come down to the properties window here and I'm just gonna type in type a command for this window and just move it up a bit just move all these select all of them move up and it's only gonna be a few lines of code on this uh, I'll just make the window start position so where it starts off at center screen and I'll just change the text in the properties and I'll put it to command window so uh, oops one second don't debug it yet cancel that I'll change the button <coughs> Okay, and uh, now what you want to do is just double click the button uh, till uh, this window comes up here and it'll say form1.vb at the top and you've got your design view and your code view. So, what we're going to do is we're going to be using if statements today and uh, to create this program, uh, you will find out what they are in a later stage. So, what we're going to type in is if text box one dot text equals then what we're going to do is open quotes the reason why we use quotes is if we type in clause and uh, there's no quotes there clause doesn't mean clause uh, so we put it in uh, quotes because that's what's going to be written in the text if that's written in the text box uh, we're going to tell it to do this then uh, me dot clause me means uh, the form so it's this form here is referring to itself as me so then what we're going to do is come under the if statement and create another if statement so text box one dot text equals open quotes again minimize I think I've spelled that right yep yeah. and quotes quotes and press enter and then then will automatically appear me dot window state equals form I'll put minimize and just click on that press enter well not enter come down below the end if I will create one more statement if text box one dot text equals open quotes max minimize close quotes press enter me dot window state equals maximize and there we go we have just created our application so I'll just run through the code as I've said uh, this basically the text box one which is this text box here when that uh, text box has clause written in it 
and the bottom one is clicked then uh, the form one which is me not me but the form one will close same for the minimize once uh, someone has written minimize and pressed ok uh, the window state will for this form will minimize same for the maximize so we'll go ahead and debug the program and uh, I'll just bring it down so we'll start off with close and once you've typed in close uh, press ok and the application closes and uh, now what we're going to do is uh, we're going to type in minimize and I'll bring it down here oops I'll bring it down here so you can see it minimize uh, press ok and it minimizes and uh, press I'll type in maximize and ok and it maximizes so that's just a, a really basic starter application for you to make on Visual Basic. As I said, download links in the description for this. Uh, that is uh, the end of this video. Thanks for watching and I will see you again later.